let me clarify something and this shouldn't take long. So back in April of 2022, I had shared a pic of Paul Butcher and Kristen Herrera. There was a, there was this thing on social media going around saying that they were together or that he got her pregnant and stuff like that. Now let's clarify this. Anybody in my generation knows who they are, but to those of you not, Paul Butcher and Kristen Herrera, they starred in a Nickelodeon sitcom called Zoe 101. That show ran from, I think, 05 to 08. And Paul played the character of Dustin, who was the little brother of the main character. And Kristen Herrera played a character named Dana. And she was the main, one of the main characters in the first season. So fast forward years later, she's pregnant. And I don't know. At first, I didn't get why people thought they were together and why they thought he got her pregnant. Let me go right here right quick. So it says, in July of 2016, Kristen Herrera announced via Instagram that she was engaged to her longtime boyfriend, Daniel Novak. Their engagement ended shortly afterward. However, in February of 2020, she announced that she was engaged to Novak again. They had their first child. Well, in November of 2021, she announced on Instagram that she was pregnant with her and Novak's first child. She gave birth to their son on May 23rd of 2022. And then later that year in October, they got married. Now I see this picture on Facebook with what appears to be them at a baby shower and she's clearly pregnant and he is in the picture with her and he's got like, you know, like a side hug thing. Like he's got his arm around her shoulders like this. And so the person who shared this and this got over 35,000 likes, hearts, wows, and surprises and all that. And it's got over 5,100 shares, over 2,300 comments. Some of the comments here are hilarious. And this person says, Dustin and Dana from Zoe 101 are having a child with a bunch of crazy emojis, all surprised and eyes crying out, whatever. So here's what most of the comments here are saying is that this isn't them together. This is just, he was invited to her baby shower and think of it as, you know, you're out with friends and you're at some event, no matter what it is, a wedding or just friends getting together at a bar or a club, or you might run into somebody somewhere in public, the store or wherever you might be at an event you know, the movie theater, wherever it may be, and you just might take pictures. And that doesn't always necessarily mean that something's going on with you and the other person. So I, at the risk of sounding arrogant or whatever, or just like, hey, this is just what I presume and what I believe to be true, is that they, along with some other people from that show, remain good friends, as that happens with a lot of people from a lot of different shows. I mean, I'm pretty sure... Diane Neal is still friends with Stephanie March and Mariska Hargitay. They all start on SVU. Uh, some of the cast members from Charmed are still good friends. I mean, you know, Shannon Doherty still seems close and friendly with Holly Marie Combs and Rose McGowan and a few others. And so you have people from this show that are still in touch. I mean, look at all the Teen Nick shows we watched. A lot of those people are still friends and hang out and whatnot. And so... That, there's really not much else to say about it. I, so my conclusion is they were there as friends. This was like a friendly get together. He was invited and he, it, basically his way of saying, hey, congrats on the baby, all that stuff. And yeah, that's about it. So I posted on that. I said, no, Paul Butcher did not get Kristen Herrera pregnant. <laughs> now, I think it's hilarious that that's even a story or that is even a thing. And, but hey, I'm also the person to sit there and say, like, if that really did happen, then hey, congratulations to them both. But yeah, so she married Daniel Novak. They had their kid before they got married. So they gave birth to the child in, in what that said, May. So yeah, that's that. So Paul Butcher is just a friend and he's not the father of that kid. So that's it. Like and subscribe. I got more coming.